Okay, welcome back. So if you remember those melody notes we learned on the high E string and the B string, now we're going to add some bass notes to those just to make things sound a bit more full. And um, we're going to get used to holding a bass note while we move the melody notes around on the top uh, two strings. So we'll start with a C chord, but really I'm just going to hold the bass note, just a C on the A string at the third fret with my third finger. And I'm going to walk up the tune, the notes of the tune, I'm going to just walk up the scale really, so I'm just going to go While I'm holding the C, I'm going to pluck the high E string at the same time. You can use your first finger for this, but I'm using my second today, I want to keep my first finger free. So So I did the C note on the A string at the 3rd fret, open E, twice, F, and G. And I didn't take the bass note off the whole time, so that's something we're going to get used to doing, is just keeping the bass note held the whole time. Then I'm going to switch the bass note to G, which is on the same fret but a different string, so just on the low E string. Then I'm going to hit the... 3rd fret with my little finger and come back down. So we get the 3rd fret on the high E, 1st fret, open, and then the 3rd fret on the B string. So, so far we have E, B, F, G. Switch your bass note. G, F, E, D. Then I'm going to go to this A minor chord. I'm going to play the A bass note again, but then the, uh, the B with my second finger still. And walk up. So C, C, D, E. And then I'm going to move on to a C chord again with the A string and the high E and the third finger on the B string at the third fret for that D note. And then we repeat that. So we get E, walking up the scale, F, G. Coming back down, switching the bass note. to A minor, C, C, D, E, then we're going to go back to this G and play the D note on the B string, 3rd fret, 1st fret, and we're going to change to a C. So you can see I'm just following the melody but I'm adding these bass notes to make it sound a bit more full. That's your homework for today, is just getting used to playing a bass note while you're holding a melody note. Um, and I'm walking up the scale, up and down the scale on the high E string and the B string. So you can take it slow and if you can tap your foot as well that would be great. So you're sort of getting yourself ready to do all this stuff on the beat. So one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, so your homework for today is to get used to holding a bass note and playing a melody note uh, on the higher strings at the same time. I just want you to take it slow uh, and try and tap your foot while you do it so you're counting each beat. I'll see you tomorrow.